Good afternoon, Tigers, and welcome to Tiger Vision News for the Monday, September 8th. I'm Big Kahuna, and this is my co-host, Curly Fry. Thanks for joining us today. Do you know anything about identifying character traits? Yeah, a little bit. Why? I heard Ms. Bowman's students learned about it. Yes, they did. Check it out. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm Maddie here with Mrs. Bowman. Tell us about your projects your students are doing. Well, the project that you see behind um, your head here is a project on character traits. And what we did was we talked about how in order to identify character traits, whether you're talking about characters in a book or in a movie or even people that you're around, you've got to watch their actions and listen to their words to determine a trait. And so after we discussed that, students were asked to identify their own character traits or what they think that their character trait is. And so they put that on the puzzle pieces, and then we put it all together as a class to show what that class's character traits look like. So that's our project. Why is it important for your students to learn about character traits? Well, it was kind of twofold. Number one, you need to understand character traits so you can analyze characters in a book or a movie. But number two, I wanted kids to understand that you should judge a person based on their actions and words and not the outside appearance of them. And so I wanted them to understand what a character trait is. It's really talking about the inside of a person or a character in a movie or a book. What else will you be learning? What else will your students be learning this year? They're going to learn lots of things. Right now we're focusing on fiction, so they're going to be learning about plot and how stories are put together and how character traits and character motivations fit into a plot or a story. And we're going to do all kinds of fun things. Thank you. I'm Maddie here with Max. What did you learn about character traits? How they can be on the outside of what they look like or inside and like how they, what they mean and how they feel. Thank you. I'm Maddie here with Peyton. What did you learn about character traits? I learned new words and I learned new meanings for character traits. Thank you. In other news, open auditions for the play A Haunting will be going will be held tomorrow from 3:20 to 5 in the auditorium. Miss Carter is looking for some students that are excited about being part of a really good play. If you're interested, go by and see her in room 105 and get more information about the audition. Speaking of auditions, we hear there's going to be a chance for some of the guys to become a part of a new choir. It's called the Tiger Corps, and the directors are looking for some highly skilled singers. If you're a part of the choir, you get to perform at Friendship and Texas Tech events throughout the year. You also get to eat snacks, play games, and have all sorts of fun at the meeting. It'll last from 4 to 5.30. Make plans to go. Turning to other news, want to buy a yearbook? In case you didn't know, here do you want to buy a yearbook? They're for sale. That's right. Miss Lowry's yearbook staff is already taking orders from this year's yearbook. The books cost $35 if you buy before January and $40 if you buy after then. So why not save five bucks? You know you're going to want one, so you might as well go ahead and get it now. Just go by Miss Lowry's room number 503 and get your yearbook today. Mr. M would like to let everyone know that after school chess club will meet this Wednesday after school. His room number is 109, and the meeting will last from 3.15 to 4.30. Be sure and make plans to join the chess club. They go all, to all sorts of chess tournaments throughout the year and have a really fun time. Now let's check in with Hula Girl and find out what's going on with our weather. Hello, it's Hula Girl here with your weather. Um, 77 degrees, partly cloudy, winds 14 miles per hour, Slight chance of precipitation. Here's your regional forecast, rain up here and down here. Here's your five day forecast. Looks like it's gonna get a little bit cooler this week with a slight chance of rain. Hi, it's Hula Girl with your weather. Back to you. Now let's check in with sports. Hello, FMS sports fans. I'm Carson, and this is Cream Puff, and here's a look at today's sports. Today, the boys on the seventh grade football teams will face their first challenge of the year when they take on Heritage Tigers. Here's more on the story. Hi, I'm Caroline with Colby. What do you expect out of tonight's football game? Uh, good. We play Heritage, and it should be a good game. Um, when and where will the games be played? Um, Monday night here, and so like 7:15. How do you think the teams will match up? Uh, pretty good, but we'll probably win. Thank you. <laughs> Hi, I'm Caroline with Maverick. Ethan. Tell us about tonight's football games. Who do we play? We play Heritage. Heritage. 
One or more of the games he played. Playing here at FMS at 750. What are you looking for out of our players? I think we're going to play good and beat them. Thank you. Hi, I'm Caroline with... What's your, what position do you play? Wide receiver. How are you preparing for tonight's game? Practicing. How do you think you'll match up against Heritage? Pretty good. Thank you. Hi, I'm Caroline with... Christopher. Button. Jonathan. What position do you play? Lineman. How are you preparing for this game? I'm trying to come to athletics every day. How do you think you'll match up against Heritage? I think I'll do pretty good. I mean, yeah, I'm really good at football, so yeah, I think I'll do pretty good. All right, thank you. <laughs> the games are scheduled to start at 6. The 8th graders play tomorrow. Good luck, Tigers. And the volleyball games are on Thursday. The girls play Terra Vista here at FMS. Start times are set for 5 and 6 o'clock. Practice hard, girls. Let's look at today's sports. Back to you. That's all we have today. Thanks for watching Tiger Vision News. Everyone have a great afternoon. We'll see you later. Until then, Tigers. Bye. Bye.